Hey everybody, this is a 1997 Nissan hard body pickup. It's got a 2.4 liter, four cylinder, and a five speed manual transmission. Just under 125,000 miles. This was bought here in Salem. And the gentleman or the family that I bought it from uh, said that they kept it in the garage uh, during their ownership. No leaks on the truck that we could find. Everything cleaned up nice and neat. Brake master cylinder looks new, but it's got the original, uh, well, that's the original booster. Uh, and that would I, I would assume is the original master cylinder, the Nissan cap. Belts are in good shape. Plugs, wires are all in uh, good shape. Air conditioning works. The tires were pretty old on it, so we went with a new tire, uh, 3110 It's got the manual hubs. So if you go into four wheel drive, you've got to twist it into lock before you engage four-wheel drive really clean truck I'll point out a couple imperfections but overall a really nice bright red gaskets look great it does look like it was kept inside from what I can tell so either way it's in great shape I think there was a, um, an, an accident, a minor collision. Collision's an awful word, but I believe this fender may have been replaced at some point. There's some notes in the Carfax on that. There's also some notes in the gallery or some pictures in the gallery uh, that show that the brakes are in great shape. We pulled the drum off the back uh, and checked those brakes and they look great. And the fronts have quite a bit of life in them too. So there's some pictures to document that. We replaced the shocks. Really clean underneath, no rust. Looks to be an all stock truck. This is a stock tire size too. The tire that came on the truck was a little bit, is the size down.
This was kind of cool too. You could see the original Nissan Leaf Spring stamping. There's a photo in the gallery if you can't see it there. So some of the imperfections that you'll see are mainly on the, the driver's side. Got some scratches right there and some right there too. Looks like there's a little bit of a, a dent in that spot. A little bit of a blemish for whatever happened there. A couple things on the tailgate, a couple scratches. Overall, a really clean tailgate though. The bumper looks like it has a little bit of an indentation there too. They're made like that from the factory, but this one looks like it's got a little bit more contour to it. Cool little mud flaps. Uh, there's also some pictures in the gallery without this bed liner, and it uh, looks really great. Just back here on the edge uh, is where there's some uh, paint scuffing, but in general, the if, it was, if I was going to keep the truck, I'd probably pull the bed liner because uh, it looks really nice without it. Got two jump seats. I left one down so you could see with it up and down. Back windows pop out like you see. It's got a nice little slider. That lens cover, uh, it's on its way from my local Nissan dealership. steering wheel had a little cover on it um, so the steering wheel is like new I'm uh, happy that it wasn't damaged by the cover that was on it no dash or no cracks on the dash It's got some aftermarket Alpine speakers. Door bottoms, uh, nothing wrong with them. Rockers, nothing wrong with them. Actually, one of the things I like the most about this truck is the glass is like perfect. Uh, I believe it's all original glass and it's just, uh, there's no water spots on it. Is kind of cool. So it looks like the same Alpine aftermarket speaker, and then this is the other other jump seat. Seat backs look great. Uh, really, the only 
imperfection on the interior is this guy right there. Um, that's there's probably some material left in there that could be uh, pulled out and uh, fixed. But rugs are great. Just a really clean interior. Or bottoms the same on the other side as this side, nice and clean.